a Wikivide Documentaries production. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Enjoy. Jerry Williams, singer. Sven Erik Fernström, better known by the stage name Jerry Williams, was a Swedish singer and actor. He began his career as the lead singer of The Violence, before launching a solo career. Early Life Williams grew up in a working-class family in Solna. The family had a one-room apartment. Williams' mother who was a nurse died, when he was only 12 years old. His father took care of him and his brother alone. He was very interested in sports, and as a youngster he played football, ice hockey and was engaged in cycle sport. He was also a member of Narva BK, a boxing club. During his younger years, Williams worked as a plumber. He did his mandatory military service in 1966. Career In 1962, Williams joined The Violence, a Swedish band that was formed in 1959 and primarily influenced by the English guitar group The Shadows. The band had a number of lineup changes, but when Williams joined in 1962, he became the frontman and the lead singer of the band. The single, Darling Nelly Gray, in 1962 was credited to Williams and the violence and became a major hit. When Little Richard performed, at the Star Club in Hamburg in 1962, both Williams along with the violence and the Beatles were opening acts. When the Beatles toured Sweden in 1963, Williams and the violence were the opening act. The violence folded in 1966. In the 1960s, Williams recorded a track with record producer Joe Meek. The track was called, The Wonder of Your Love. It was never released, and was found amongst Meek's tapes when he died. It can be heard on YouTube. Williams' music style was soul influenced by the end of the 1960s, which led to the song, Keep On, which became a hit in Sweden in 1969. He returned to the rock and roll based music in the early 1970s and performed with the band Roadwork until the early 1980s. Also during the 1970s he toured with the band The Tell Stars. In 1983 Williams acted in the film G Saw My Gem in Scab. He also acted in the musical, Cats. In 1989, Williams released the song, Did I Tell You, which became his biggest hit song and the record, JW, which led to him being discovered by a new generation. A music video was also filmed for, Did I Tell You. Williams during this time also had the stage show act, Liv Poor Borson, at Hamburger Boers in Stockholm. Williams followed it up, with more shows such as Live and Jive at Hamburger Boers in 1999, Jerker at Storat Aarteon in Gothenburg and Gotteljohn in Stockholm in 2002, as well as, Ringside, at Skeleteton in 2005, and Lorenzberg Stettern in Gothenburg in 2006. In 1985, Williams was awarded the Loess Culture Scholarship, and in 1991 he was pictured on a Swedish stamp. During the Eurovision Song Contest 1989, he was a part of the choir for the song, Endag, which was performed by Tommy Nielsen representing Sweden. In 1986, he lost almost 2.9 million reportedly as a result of mismanagement of funds by his financial advisor. Williams was a host, for some RIP1 on Sverius Radio on 5 August 2009. In 2010, an art project featuring his work was exhibited at Jorteborg's Konsthall in Gothenburg. In 2009 and 2010 he had the show, Dynamite, at Rondo in Gothenburg and Tyrol in Stockholm. He performed in All Sang Poor Skansen which has been broadcast on SVT on several occasions. On 17 January 2013, Williams premiered his farewell tour Jerry the Farewell Show at Circus in Stockholm. Over 100,000 tickets were sold for the entire Pan Sweden tour, for most of 2013. Also in 2013 Williams cooperated with opera singer Milena Ernman on the latter's album I Decembered. He sang, Counting Miracles, the opening track of the album as a duet with Ernman. The song charted at Svensktoppen. It placed as number one on 6 April 2014 language. One of Williams' trademarks was the unique language and speech pattern he used throughout his life. It was a kind of sociolect based on old Stockholm slang, mixed with words and expressions used by touring musicians, notably smaller bands touring by bus. He also invented words, metaphors and expressions of his own. 
some of which would filter out and become part of the Swedish way of talking. Sometimes when he appeared in national TV, the broadcast company would subtitle the program in standard Swedish. Personal Life Williams was a lifelong communist. Off stage he led a very private life with his family, dogs and training. He was an AXA supporter. Williams had been married since 1977, and had two daughters from that marriage. Before getting married he was a single father with a son. He lived in Terby at the time of his death. Williams died from cancer in Terby on 25 March 2018, aged 75. Brought to you by Wikivideo Documentaries. Would you like to know more?